out to Jesus, Father, we bless your holy name. We worship you, Lord, take all the glory in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. This is God's own channel with Evangelist Sarah. You are welcome. The Lord bless you. The Lord bless every member of this household. It is well with each child of God. Jesus love you. And I love you. Please, family, like this video, share, subscribe. Tell somebody about this ministry. God bless you as you do that. In the name of Jesus Christ, amen. Hallelujah. Glory to Jesus. Glory, Abba Father. Glory to the King of Kings. Child of God, you are on a new ground. When I got this word, God had me to tell this person. Say, hold the new ground. Protect your new ground with all jealousy. Hallelujah. The enemy already know that you are not equally yoked with them. You are not equally yoked with unbelievers. So you are not supposed to live like them. You are not supposed to be in the same level. There is a new level that you are in right now. And that new level, when you hold it so strongly because it is a new level. When the Bible says, come out among them, it says, come out among them and be ye separated. So when you come out among them, come out among sinners, among wickedness, among iniquity, when you come out and you choose to be different, child of God, it means that you have left that level. Now you are, you are not in a new ground, in a new level. So what God has me to tell you is that protect the new ground. Because when you protect that new ground, when you hold the new ground with all jealousy, with the word of God, with the things of the Lord, when you hold on to that new ground, though the enemy will want to shake it because they already see that you have separated yourself from them. They already see that you are no longer yoked together with them. You are not equal with them anymore. You are not equal with them anymore. In other words, your level now is different. So when you come out among them and you are not equally yoked with the unbelievers, you find yourself in a new ground. And that new ground, the enemy will always want to shake it. So when you hold on to that new ground, you see that the new ground becomes a higher ground. That is where the message is going. Hold on to the new ground. Because they know already that you are not equally yoked with them. They know that you have come out among them. You are not in the same circle with them. So your new ground might be the, a target that they want to shake. That they want to break. That they want to destroy. Child of God, hold on to your new ground. You are not equally yoked with the unbelievers. You are not equally yoked with the things of the world. So when God says come out and you come out and you stand on a new ground, be rest assured that many will come for that new ground. Why? Because they want to shake it so that you will go to the new ground. They will want to shake the new ground. Hold the new ground. Hold the new level. Hold the new territory. Hallelujah. As you hold on to it, you will see that Things are changing. And that new ground will become a higher ground. Child of God, you will walk on the higher ground. As long as you are not equally yoked with the enemy, no matter how they try to shake your new ground, how, to, how they try to shake your level, child of God, I tell you, you will walk on the higher ground. I pray for you, child of God. As you hold on to that new level, as you hold on to that new ground, you will grow from grace to grace in the name of Jesus. It is well with you, Jesus. Love you. And I love you with the love of Christ. I remain a sister, Evangelist Sarah. By the grace of God, I will see you again. Bye-bye.